So this is around two kilos of pork. Uh, one kilo is um, pork uh, shoulder and the other is pork bun. And I just cook them into like two inches or two and a half inches. And I'm browning them with like its own oil. So I'm following the recipe from um, Simple and Easy Cooking Channel. And the pork curry. Uh, simple and Easy Pork Curry. But um, I'm making changes as we go. Like for example, she put oil and fries this. I just made all the pieces with like all the fatty pieces over here and then all the fat uh, non fatty is around on top. So I've got like oil from the fat and now I'm just like frying all them in this oil. So I'll do that for five minutes so till it gets like brownish and then we move ahead. So my gas mask all this while has been on high heat. You can see the color changing here to the brown. So I'm gonna add my onions now and then follow the rest of it. So now it's on medium gas mark and then I'm like stirring it out. I put like three uh, medium to large size onions. I'm gonna take a hold but I want one more. Because I feel like maybe one needed. Let me see. Let me see. They're all just getting nice. Uh, the recipe will be mentioned in the uh, description box anyway. I'll mention it in the, one, the changes I've made now. So this is how it looks now. I've added one big large onion um, to this and now I've just put it on medium gas mark again after stirring it. I also added some salt at this stage by the way. And I'm cutting, uh, so I've taken one <laughs> pot of garlic. If you follow the channel, you know we love garlic. So I'm going to crush them here and then after i crush them i'm going to dump them into the pork now while i'm adding the uh, the crushed garlic i'm adding also the turmeric obviously i've added more than what she's added because like you know we love turmeric too so it's really good for health and i always put more when i'm making non vegetarian food okay so now i'll see you towards the end of the unless i make any changes on the way what I have, I added some water after adding the chili powder. By the way, I added uh, one tablespoon of normal red chili powder, which is hot. And then I added one, uh, two tablespoons of, sorry, one and a half of that. And then two tablespoons of Kashmiri chili powder for the color. So you can see it's a nice orangey color because of the turmeric we put. Otherwise, it would be more reddish. But yeah, so we're so good. Let me see what she does next. But I definitely added water because I want the pork to cook. So if she doesn't cover it, I'm going to cover it and cook it. Uh, cook it at this stage for a bit. So this is how it looks. Look the end. I check the temperature of the pork to see if it's cooked and it's all cooked and wonderful. It tastes amazing. I already tasted it. It's one of those simple but yet flavorful and that I think is going to stay in my collection for quite a bit. I love cooking quick and easy. So this was a nice slow cook, non-cooker uh, pork recipe. In fact, I think uh, apart from uh, just one another dish, this is the second dish of pork that I have cooked without using the pressure cooker. So yeah try this recipe and enjoy it thank you for watching so here it is ready i'm ready to eat it with some roti or paratha it tastes amazing with roti and paratha also with rice but i prefer it with roti delicious curry a nice slow cooked pork easy curry This is how it is with rice. I love it with um, the layered paratha as well, but it's really nice with rice too. It's an amazing curry. It's mildly spicy, like maybe medium spicy, between mild and medium. But then you can control it on the chili powder, so you can put less chili powder. And I really like the flavor of the meat because we slow cooked it for so long without the pressure cooker. It really tastes amazing. So definitely give this a try.